You really killed all those abominations? I didn't think it was possible. I thought we'd all die here. I'm sure you need supplies after that, don't you? Please take my stuff. We're doing a little bit better on the inventory now, not fully, but good enough for now. Yeah, because some of the armors, I think it'll be easier if we check it back at the camp, because here we don't have everybody. Actually, we do have everybody, but I can't check everything as easy. So I'll leave it off for now. And I know we have a bunch of stuff in the tower still. There's something in the basement that we set free. The whole summoning ritual stuff. And then the scammer guy. The fake book. Bei Ha Jom. We're looking for someone with this name. But this person might not be inside the tower. We're just casually looking out for this person. But I'm gonna put this off for now. Because the entire point of why I rushed over to the tower is because we had to solve the situation at Redcliffe. So I think it makes sense that we go back and tend to that first, and then we'll come back and look for the chests, unlock them, or whatever. Alright? Anything else? My men have scouted the tower. It's a mess, but the abominations are gone. You are very thorough. I'm impressed. Yeah, no thanks to you. <laughs> Someone had to do it. And I am thankful you arrived when you did. All is well, but I'm afraid I can't stay. I shan't keep you then. Farewell. Yeah, go do literally nothing then. I'm glad I'm still alive, but the Circle's future still remains to be seen. Just be quiet. It's over. Thank the Maker. Yeah, let's get going. We'll just go directly back to Redcliffe. Not even the party camp. I still think the other way... The other- I mean, why is there no- do we not have boats? Are boats not a thing? Oh. I bring word, sire. There are demands from the Banorn that you step down from the Regency. All how? They are said to be gathering their forces, as are your allies. It appears it will be civil war after all, despite the Darkspawn. Pity. I also have an interesting report. There seem to be Grey Wardens who survived Ostagar. How, I don't know. But they will act against you. I have arranged for a... a solution. With your leave. The Antivan Crows send their regards. An assassin? Against Grey Wardens, we will need the very best, <laughs> Wow. And the most expensive. Just get it done. He actually seems a bit more troubled than I imagined. Loghain, I mean. He hasn't said much, so we don't really know how he feels. Ah, this must be the guy then. Zevran Arainai. The crows send their regards, the Antivan crows. Between the Devinter Imperium, Ravain, and the Free Marches sits the nation of Antiva. Wait, why are we getting this? We shouldn't be getting it now. Are we supposed to know who this guy is now? Although it possesses few resources of its own, Antiva's location makes it a center for trade in the north, and the capital, Antiva City, is the wealthiest in the world. Antiva has virtually no army. The monarchy is too weak to support one. Most Antivans would be hard-pressed to even name the current king, as the true power lies in the hands of a dozen merchant princes, each with a personal army, and each locked in a constant struggle for power against all others. Anyone would think, then, that Antiva would be a ripe target for invasion by one of her neighbors, but even the Kunari leave Antiva alone for one very good reason, the House of Crows. The most efficient, most feared, and most expensive guild of assassins in the world calls Antiva their home, and their reputation alone defends the borders. Wait, what is this? It's a character, right? Like, Zevran Arainai? It's the name of the guy that we saw? It's not a place, but I can't tell! <laughs> this is a name! This is a name? But there's nothing about the person themselves, actually. Okay, I guess that's alright. It's, um, just about general Antiva things. Where are we? Oh! He's right here! Hello, everybody. Get ready, guys. Yes. 
This was the guy that, you know, speak, speak the words, or whatever the thing said. We might want to put some people here, you know? Just hold some people here. Because these guys, if this goes south, there's going to be a lot of guys for cleanup. Ah, a fellow traveler of the fair lands. Are you a seeker, perchance? <laughs> My packs are light, but I have a tome of strange origin. The Deus V. Eternus, rumored to be the last message to a sinful world from the Maker himself. Sorry, I'm agnostic. <laughs> so that's what he was doing. He was selling the books actively. Hmm. Not so strange. I have five copies. Ah, will the wonders of this all too small a land never cease? Well, they will for you. Get them! Yeah, all right. All right, these are people, should be okay, but the mage. Everyone, let's go for the mage first. The gun. Oh, we're leaving the... We're leaving the mages to fend for themselves. Is that okay? Okay, that's good. Now, these two... These two should deal with this guy. Just look in front of you. And instead, you can probably just... Figure something out here. You're following me. You want a one-on-one? -on -one? You want a 1v1 me? We're quite far away from each other. I don't like this. Sten should probably do a pommel thing too. He's being struck on multiple sides. Oh, okay. Sure. Everyone doing okay? Thank you, Stan. Beautiful. Well, he didn't give me an option. He was so... he knew he had it coming. The moment I said, I had five copies, he wants to kill me already. Well, whatever you want, I guess. Were we supposed to kill him? Cameo Cowl. Plus two cunning. Cunning for a mage? Had a good bit of money on him, though. So now what? You had a first and rather final meeting with a profiteering forger, Beira Jom. Oh well, sorry, so sorry. <laughs> Should I go back to the tower and tell people that I ended his life? They probably don't even care. They might be embarrassed. Embarrassed that they fell for such a cheap trick. Speak he the words, or <laughs> the typo. I thought that was just how they spoke back in the day. <laughs> no. Is that it? Alright. Redcliffe! Why don't we have boats? Why can't we cross the lake? Is the lake dangerous? We still haven't gone- wait. Um... I kind of want to bring back Liliana and Alistair because I feel like they should see the conclusion because we started with them. Oh shoot. It's okay, we'll tell them about it back at home. His bones are still here. Oh, win! I'll do your level up right now. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess for the mages, it's really just going to be willpower and magic, mainly. You are a spirit healer. Not all entities of the fate are demonic. Many are benevolent entities, consisting of life energy, which can be called upon to mend flesh and heal disease. Hold on, what? Wait, when we use magic, are we, are we drawing power from the fate? To me, right now, the, the fate is the place where demons are but these two things don't have to be mutually exclusive. Spirit healers focus on channeling the energies granted by these spirits, making them indispensable members of a party of adventurers. Mm. Drawing on the power of spirits in the Fade to be used in this realm. Petrify. Petrify. Turning a target into stone for 20 seconds. That's long. Creatures already made of stone are immune, like golems. 
should I give you? No, you should be a healer. I'm sorry. I shouldn't be looking at that. Heroic defense? Or mass rejuvenation. Cannot do this one yet. Heroic defense. Glyph of paralysis. Paralyze the first enemy who crosses the bounds of a glyph on the ground for 10 seconds. That could be good. Spell Wisp. Summons a Wisp. Can the Wisp attack? Spirit. Right, so Entropy is Destruction. These are pretty good too. These are like kind of draining. Creation Primal. Well, let's focus on the Creation branch for Win. I guess. She's not really going to be like a um, Fireball person. Sure. Are you all okay? Mages! There are mages here! I do not like this talk of possessions and spirits and... and magic. It is unnatural. Ah, there you are. We have brought Lyrium and begun preparations for the ritual. We can start any time. So only one person can go through? Yes. We haven't sufficient lyrium at present to send more than one mage into the Fade. Are you sure this is the only way? It only works because the child gave himself to the demon willingly. If the demon takes over the host forcibly, we must slay the abomination. Oh. We have only enough lyrium for one attempt. I hope you succeed. Such a young lad deserves better than execution. Does that mean that if you know that you're gonna be ending up possessed, you should surrender? Because if you don't, then you just become an abomination. But whereas in this case, we still have a chance of bringing him back. Do you have any last minute advice? It truly depends on the manner of demon. It sounds like a spirit of greed and desire. One of the more powerful in the hierarchy. It will likely engage you in dialogue and tempt you with an offer. Avoid it. Making deals with demons never turns out well. Ah, uh, it depends on what they offer. I, I can be convinced. I'm, I'm very easy in some aspects. <clears throat> I, I mean, uh, let's do this now. <laughs> Magic. Very well. <sighs> Who will go into the Fade? I can't go. Only a mage can go. Morgan? Well, when we started the situation in Redcliffe, the only person that could have gone is Morgan. Joan? I don't know, man. I don't know how strong he is. Are blood mages all strong by default? Win? First Enchanter Irving. He's gotta be the strongest mage in all of the lands. By the way, it doesn't seem like the situation has changed, right? We're still okay? The one day travel to the Circle Tower and then one day travel back, and then five weeks at the Circle Tower itself? <laughs> Was that okay? <laughs> I would like you to go, Irving. Me? Confront the demon? Uh, this is a lot to ask. But you're old and wise. I think you owe me. I suppose I do at that. So be it. I shall confront this demon myself. Let us begin at once. You're the best chance we have, quite literally. Oh my god, you're joking me. We're back in the fate again! <sighs> okay. It is what it is. <laughs> Are we gonna be- oh! Are we gonna come back here on multiple occasions? Hold up. Whoa, I have like 20 spells! And I gotta get used to it too because I'm here by myself. Arcane Bolt, Heal, Lightning, Shock. Glyph of Paralysis, Arcane Shield. I can't control anyone else so I can't even do tactics for you because... You can't activate the tactics for as long as I'm controlling you. Glyph of Neutralization. Okay, let's put all the glyphs above, maybe. 
Turning into a spider? No, that's not the... <laughs> Herbalism, screw off. Affliction Hex. Contagious Hex. Do you have Fireball, Irving? You should have everything, shouldn't you? Chain Lightning. The bolt forks repeatedly, jumping to nearby enemies. That sounds fun. Healing. I don't have any potions. Healing is important. Oh, Spell Wisp. Sustained. We should do it right now. Spell Wisp. Anything else sustained? How much mana do you have anyway? Archange. This is sustained. A shield. Oh, you got a lot of mana. I think this should be okay. Tempest. Fierce lightning storm. Friendly fire doesn't matter. There's nothing here. Okay, we'll just... We'll just roll. Is that you, Connor? I can hear you! I'm coming! Who is that? Father! Where are you? Is anyone out there? Hello? I don't understand. I want to go home. Blessed art thou who exists in the sight of the Maker. But it's only Arl, Eamon, and Connor in here. But a lot of times. Please, Father. I only want to help you. You there. Have you seen my son? I can, I can hear him, but I cannot find him. This blasted fog has me turning in circles. If I see Arl Eamon here, does that mean that he's really here? Because in the quote-unquote real world, our world, he's sick right now. We don't know why or how. It could be possible that his spirit is here. Mm, try to get through to the Arl? They're giving me a choice though, that's strange. You are in the fade, good man. A demon has you trapped here. But is my son in danger? He is, but I will do my best to see that all of us emerge from this unscathed. Trust me, my Arl. Yes, I, I, I trust you. We must help my son. But I can never find him in this fog. You must find Connor. Please, I beg you. I will. I will. Don't you worry. Is that you? We got out of the fade for like 30 minutes. Now we're back in. Connor? You wanted to save your dad really badly, didn't you? Who are you? Are you the one that made father ill? Tell me now. Be nice. Be calm, child. I have come to help you. No! You're here to hurt father. I know it. I won't let you. Oh, whoa. Close! Please, close! I suppose that's okay. She's got a little clam there, so Come she's not. Me, pretty thing. She's not exactly naked. <laughs> I need some stunning stuff. Let me just start with a shock. No, that's area. We don't need an area thing. Tempest. These are gigantic. Penalty. Penalty to resistances. Okay, you know what? Let's do it. Okay, so we have that now. Paralyzes the fir first repulsion, knocks them back. Glyph of warding. I don't have allies. So this is useless then. I don't have allies. Knocks back enemies. I don't think I'd want to do that. Neutralizes all magic. That's not good because I can't do anything. Let's try the paralysis one then. I can just start wailing. Curve and gas. 
We fight for the circle. That was probably not the only time we have to do that. That was way too easy. Unless if it's just because Irving is strong. Larium. Connors. You! You're the one making father sick! No, the damn demon. I'll help him! You can't stop me! Wait, so the demon made the father sick? And the demon went to Connor. Am I dead? Am I dreaming? I don't understand any of this. And she's like, do you want to save your dad? I'll help get you. Get out of here! You have to get out! Even though she's the one who did this in the first place. Why do you keep hurting me? Why are you trying to stop me? Try to communicate. Please, child, listen to me. I am here to help you. I will not speak with you! Trespasser! I will drive you out! Okay, there are multiple. Well, let's do paralysis on one of them at least. Does it work on both of them? Or just one? The first enemy that crosses its bounds. Yeah. And then we'll just like... I will not die today. Oh, I trapped the other one instead. So you're gone. Are you stronger? Ten seconds is a long time. Was that it? I'll stop you! I will! Does it make sense though? I'm going back the way I came from. That doesn't seem like a way of moving forward. Let me just check. Oh! Connor! Wait, this isn't even the same place anymore. Father wonders, seeking me, trapped within my web. All is as it should be. Why must you interfere? Reason. Because you have taken a child, demon. Our world is not your world. Surely you must realize this by now. No. It is time for you to go now. Do not persist, or things will go very badly for you. Okay, I got that one. The demon is not as strong as the thing. There's two actually. We gotta be careful. Anything I can do to like stop them? Okay, neutralization? I don't think we want that either, so just put that one away. If we just stand here, are we gonna be okay? Okay, I'm I'm dying, I'm dying. Cause I'm burning. Do I have any other skills that do more? Oh, I mean this one is still good for me. Good for me alone, right? Even if I just by myself. Oh, I'm dead already. <laughs> Okay, so there's gonna be two, right? Maybe I should step back a little bit first. Make sure they're coming from the same direction to begin with. I think it's better to stop a demon than the... the rage demon, than that demon. This one is really weak. Easily. Just heal up a little bit. These things. This is so overkill, let's try it. Did it hurt? <laughs> it's not the beginning of a pickup line. I'm not here to pick you up. Oh, I think I'm hurting myself by being inside here. 
something to be a little bit careful about. So in the future, we gotta move a little bit further away. Electricity damage also drains stamina equal to the amount of damage dealt. Yeah, oh, this is the chain lightning one. This is the tempest. Right. Oh, chain lightning is probably what I want. Yeah, like that. Okay. Oh! We got a lyrium vein here. Very well. No more illusions. Now we meet face to face. You see my true form and stand in my domain. It is here I am most powerful. And yet I have no wish to engage your power, nor should you be so eager to engage mine. Perhaps we should converse instead? <laughs> I don't think that's a good idea, but I want to see what's up her sleeve. I kind of wish the, the Zara demons looked different though. Because they seem individualistic enough, yet this one looks the exact same as the previous one we saw. Two, actually. I demand that you release the boy at once, foul spirit! Release him? Do not be foolish, old man. This is my place of power. I do as I wish here. Truly, is there no room for negotiation? Let us speak, human. Surely there is something you desire. Hmm? You think me a fool? There is nothing I wish from the likes of you! Alas, I can't choose. Sad. Very well then. If you wish a battle, you will have it. Let us see if your power matches your boldness, creature. I kind of wish they would have just gone with like a... Because I didn't get to choose there just now. I wish they would give me options like, I want a lot of money or I want... I want a happy family, whatever, and then give an instant game over for trying to do it because she eats your brain alive or something. But no, we can't even choose. Okie dokie. You... I don't think you'll be too bad as long as you're by yourself. Oh, stealing mana. Stealing mana probably when I run out. Okay, let, let's try the chain lightning. Mm hmm. Anyone else coming? If not. Ow. I'm just gonna do a glyph right here. Yeah. Bye bye. You just charging up or? Oh, I don't know what I pressed. Doesn't matter. <laughs> that's a, that's a bit too much, I think. Okay, that's not cool. That is not cool. How's my health? Not full. Get a whole bunch of them. Ah, then we can see which one is the real one. We need to heal too. Okay, so one of its attacks is based on the cone thing, so we can run away from that one. I want some mana as well. Yeah, like that. I can run away a little bit, I think. Alright. But rather than running away, let's just... Chain lightning, please. Actually, there's nothing, there's no chaining to be had here. If you screw that, it's resisting. Is it... Should I do like a hex? Oh, I'm out of mana. That's really not good. We just do regular attacks. I'm worrying so much, but this might be faster. Oh, that's all I had to do. I don't have to do a freaking Tempest thing. 
We fight for the circle. Ha! You will be mine! You know what? Stand still. What? What happened? Paralysis explosion. The magic power of a glyph derives from the purity of its shape. When two glyphs overlap and their lines become confused, particularly when the glyph's effects are directly opposed as with the glyphs of paralysis and repulsion, the magic has no choice but to dissipate instantly and explosively. <gasps> instantly paralyzing all those within a 7.5 me meter radius for 20 seconds. Oh, we're both paralyzed. That's hilarious. <laughs> well, okay, well, um... How's your day going? How are you? Are you alright? You're gone. Nice. Oh yeah, there was a whole lyrium vein that I just completely ignored. <laughs> are we good? Mm, all the people from the night. So it is over. Connor is his old self. He does not seem to remember anything, which is a blessing. I suppose we will need to send him to the Circle of Magi's Tower for... training, once the war is over. It's so odd to think of the boy as a mage, of all things. Eamon has much to mourn and rebuild, should he recover. But at least he could be thankful that both his son and wife are safe. I owe you my deepest thanks. I had nearly... I can scarcely believe Connor is the boy he once was. There is still the matter of Jowan. His poisoning Eamon began this whole mess, yet he lives. I must decide what becomes of him. We will hold him for Eamon to decide his fate. If he doesn't recover, Jowan's fate is sealed. What do you think? That sounds fine with me. He did try to... kill him. But, um, the reason why he tried to do so was because Loghain asked him to, and at that point he had no reason to think that Logan was not a traitor. Or was a traitor, right? So that's a bit... He was doing it under the assumption that it would help redeem him from being a bad forbidden blood mage. Why do you want my opinion? You spoke with him, have you not? You know what he has done better than I do, even. Would you find him useful? I would not trust him, but I would not presume to tell my brother what to do. Well, let's wait, right? I don't... I don't think it's your decision to make. What do you mean? He is responsible for many of the problems here and is a Malefica as well. Yes, but he also helped brainstorm a solution which led to our current situation with both Connor and Isolde being okay. He did seem genuine enough in trying to um, make things right. <sighs> this shouldn't be a matter for the king. The king is Logan right now. If we just give him to the Circle of Magi, I think he'll be... They'll make him a Tranquil or something. Or maybe they'll just kill him. Exactly. He's a Circle of Magi's responsibility. Perhaps you are correct. But that is Eamon's decision, not mine. I'm sorry. Jowan stays in the dungeon for now. But our task is not done yet. Whatever the demon did to my brother, it seems to have spared his life. But he remains comatose. We cannot wake him. Oh no. <sighs> The urn of sacred ashes will save Eamon. Oh my god. <sighs> Isn't there some other way to heal him? What about magic? It has been tried and we will continue trying. Perhaps the demon's absence will make a difference. However, the relic is another option. My husband funded the research of a scholar in Deneran, a brother Genetivi. He has been studying the inscriptions on Andraste's birth rock. 
When Eamon fell ill, I sent the knights to speak to Jenny TV. I hoped that he had finally discovered the location of the urn of sacred ashes itself. They were unable to locate Jenny TV. In desperation, I sent more knights in search of the brother, or some clue of the urn's location. I am aware. I will do it, but I want to see what, you know, I, I do have other stuff to do. Other world saving stuff. I have the dark spawn to contend with. Eamon is well respected and powerful. He can pull Ferelden together. If you wish to fight the Darkspawn, you will need him. That is true. That's the reason why we even came here to begin with. Speaking of which, the Circle Tower, they didn't even ask for the treaties or anything. It's more because we saved them that they're helping us, not because of the paper. What will you be doing in the meantime? I must organize Eamon's knights as they return, draft new soldiers, and prepare the army to fight. I shall hand Redcliffe back to Eamon when he awakens, and in a state where it can be of some use in the coming war. Truly, what other choice do I have? Okay, I will see if I can find this relic. No one else can. Even if I wish to do it myself, I cannot abandon Redcliffe to its own devices. Perhaps you could seek out the brother's home in Denerim and see if any clues remain on his whereabouts. It is the only place to begin the search, I think. I must go to the hall and begin rebuilding. I wish you luck, and may the Maker go with you. I think now we can probably pause a little bit and maybe check out some of the other stuff. <laughs> when we're fine, we are in good company here, It's things are okay, I think. Alright-ish. <sighs> I pray that Eamon awakens soon. I didn't think he wouldn't wake up, because Connor's okay, and he's not. The First Blight, Chapter 2. Read that later. That's like a history thing. That poor little boy. I just can't bear to think what he must have gone through. He doesn't remember, so I suppose that's... Uh, could be worse. It... <laughs> Forgetting entirely might not be a good thing, though, because he, he probably learned some things in this whole ordeal, right? Like not talking to weird demons and letting them possess your body. But now he forgot about it again, so if another demon came along, I'm scared he would make the same choice. You. You're the one who saved me. Do you remember nothing? I remember having a bad dream. There was a very scary lady. But she went away. I hope father gets better soon. He will. Won't he? Let's hope so. Yeah... That's a bit concerning because I thought the whole reason why the Arl wasn't doing well was because of the demon, but the demon's gone and he's still not okay. Which means there might be something more at play here. And our solution right now, the urn, is not exactly... It's more like a desperate thing that we're trying because we don't know what else to do. It's not like, oh, if we do find the urn, it'll work for sure. Oh, we're in the upper floors now. Yeah, I looted everything already, <laughs> so we don't have to look at this place again. Okay. Well, does anyone want to talk downstairs? Is Irving back to the tower? Probably. You return. Might you have news? What is Arl Eamon's condition? Unchanged, I'm afraid. We've tried more magical healing, but nothing works. As time passes, I become more and more convinced the urn might be our only hope. Are you calling Eamon's knights back? Yes, but they are returning slowly. No doubt the war's progress, as well as the Darkspawns, hinders many of them. I should go. Then I must resume my duties. The civil war continues, and Loghain is no doubt angered Redcliffe has not been disabled. Good luck, my lady. You are a great and noble woman. I hope it continues to go well, for all our sakes. I hope so too. Let's have faith. It is good you resolve this demon business. Now we must either revive the Arl, or allow Ban Tegan to take his place. Can we not talk about it like... <laughs> it's a very... the way you put it. Oh, this door... This door is open now. The main hall door. Yeah, please don't talk about it like it's so sterile. 
they're people and we're trying to we're trying to heal them and all this. 